Hey y'all, SEMA 2017 and I got a 72 convertible Corvette that's just way cool. Let me get the camera turned around and we'll take a quick look at it. Vinny, thanks for giving me some time today to uh, check out this hot rod. Sure. Tell me a little bit about it. Well, it's a uh, 1972 Corvette that uh, we built uh, here at my shop at Vinny's Hot Rods in Alabaster, Alabama. And uh, we did everything in-house with help of a few people, obviously. Right. And uh, we debuted it here at the SEMA show. Okay. Tell me uh, some of the changes or some of the things you've done to it. It's not a stock 70 what it's one? 72. 72. 72. It, no, it's not stock. It is close to it, though. We added the, the things that we changed completely would have been the side vents, the rear spoiler, uh, you know, the fit and finish. Obviously, all the bumpers have been pulled in. Front bumper has got the peak taken out of it, and it's been uh, tucked on the sides and then pulled in closer to the body like, like most people do. Right. Uh, we made all the engine base sheet metal panels to cover the intake for the motor. Uh, the full interior is also hand-built. The door panels are all hand-built. They, they resemble the stock door panel, but uh, Heather did make all of them. Right. And then the seats she also made using the uh, seat frames, but the foam has all been shaped by her. Uh, and then the, uh, you know, the it's got the LS3, 525 GM crate motor, and then six-speed transmission, bare brakes, ride tech, suspension, uh, classic instrument did the gauges. Um, so it's got all the all the fun stuff on. What about like um, chassis and things like that? Uh, well, it's got a stack chassis, okay. but it's got all the the, the ride tech coilovers and their two turn system and all that stuff that they make. So it is coilovers, not it on is. air. Yeah, it is cold. What size wheels are you running on it? It the wheels are 18. I don't know what the tires are, man. I don't remember at this point. How wide are they? They're 10. Okay. They're all 10. the way around. They are. They fit great. They're Budnick wheels. Uh, Budnick always treats us real nice. And then it's Continental tires. I love Continental tires. Now. Oh yeah. They treat me real nice. Yeah. How long did it take you to build it? Uh, we built it in uh, four months. Four months? We built it in four months, yeah, man. What condition was it when you got it? Uh, the way you would just find one. So really? it was, it was uh, we had it, but uh, nothing had been done to it. Right. So essentially, we, we basically stripped it all down and kind of built it up from there. The first two months were just weekends and nights. And then the last two months, everybody was on it just to match scramble to get the thing finished. Man, it turned out awful nice, Thank you, dude. thank I mean, you. There's no way you'd think you did that in four yeah. months. Yeah, yeah. Anybody you need to give a shout out to? Uh, well, just my crew more than anything, man. Right. My fiance Heather, uh, and then all of the guys back at the shop, Moon, Jose, Jeremiah, uh, Mike, Jake, those, all those guys, uh, you know, put in time just that they didn't have to do. Right. You know, I own the vehicle, so oh, it's your they car. were doing it all off the clock. They would stay all night long. So are you yeah. gonna, are you just for sale now? Uh, it will be. Yeah. Uh, but for now, I just, I, I've actually never had an old vehicle of my own. Right. So this is my first that runs and drives. I got And you. is obviously at the SEMA show. So we're going to keep it for the year, show it around, go to the good guy shows, NSRA, all that stuff. And then uh, probably sell it. At it's the, one of uh, my favorite generation Corvettes. They're cool. I really dig they're that, cool. that, I feel that like, generation. Uh, I feel like a lot of people don't like that. Yeah, you know, it's, the, it's like the, the, it's the mutt right. kind of deal. Like nobody really likes it. But uh, I think done right, I think it looks really cool. Yeah, no. You know? But uh, yeah, it, it worked out great, man. Cool. Well, brother, I sure appreciate you giving me a few minutes today. Sure, sure, no problem. Thank, Thank you. you. So there you go from SEMA 2017, a 72 Corvette. I call it a convertible. It may even be a Roadster. I never asked about the top. But anyways, hope you all have enjoyed it. See Hey, y'all, make sure you subscribe to this channel and visit scottydtv.com for an easy way to search the hundreds of videos I have posted. Either click the link in the description or the one at the end of this video.